the NDP uh, government, they've actually screwed up beer policy twice since they've been in government in just uh, about a year and a half. But this most recent move by the NDP was to eliminate the what was called the graduated markup structure of beer, which meant that if you're a small brewery, you pay a certain lower rate of tax, medium-sized brewery kind of in the middle, bigger breweries like Molson Coors, Labatt, Sleeman, they paid the highest rate of tax, which was $1.25 a litre. The NDP government raised taxes on all breweries, so now all of, even the little guys are paying uh, that high rate of tax that only the big ones paid before. Um, and then they're, they're taking corporate welfare and subsidizing a few local breweries in Alberta, essentially picking winners and losers in the beer market. Now, they've said that this policy was intended to help small local breweries, but we have emails showing that uh, that the big breweries, Molson Coors and Labatt, raised their prices on their discount beers basically immediately after this NDP beer tax hike came into effect. Effectively, what they could do now was raise prices on their beers without it impacting their competition or their competitive edge because they're their competition, the smaller and medium-sized brewers, had to raise their prices as a result of the tax hike because, you know, they couldn't afford to to take a loss at that rate. So now, essentially, it's a huge lose-lose for consumers in Alberta, whether you like neat craft beer from out of province or whether you like the discount beer, you know, the cheap, uh, the cheapest beer that you can get from the big beer companies, you're paying more for beer across the board. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel Update. Want even more of The Rebel? Well, click here to become a premium member.